Hello, I am Halima from Marrakesh. Today we are going to prepare a chicken tagine with caramelized tomatoes. First, we are going to prepare the caramelized tomatoes. The tomatoes are already washed. Cut them in half. Let's grate the tomatoes. The tomatoes are now grated and the pan is preheated. Add the tomatoes to the pan. Then season with salt. Just a little salt. and a cinnamon stick. Cook until all the water evaporates, then we'll continue the process. While the tomatoes are cooking, let's start on the tagine. We use a whole chicken and some onions. Let's start with the onions. For one chicken, I use two onions. Rinse the onions. Now chop the onions into small dice. I will place the chopped onions in the tagine. Place it in there. Now add a tablespoon of vegetable oil. and a tablespoon of butter. 
cover the tagine and set it aside to cook while we marinate the chicken. We are now going to prepare the chicken marinade. We'll need about half a teaspoon of turmeric, a teaspoon of ground ginger, half a teaspoon of cinnamon, salt to taste, black pepper, about half a teaspoon, a few saffron threads, which will add a delicious flavor to the sweet and savory tagine. I will also use two garlic cloves. Grate the garlic. Add just a little water to mix the marinade for the chicken. Now add the chicken and rub it with the marinade. Just like this. Let's check on the onions in the tagine. Place the chicken in the tagine on top of the onions. We will not need to add any water because the onions will release their liquids. If the tagine starts to dry up later, add a little bit of water. Let's check back on the caramelized tomatoes. A lot of the water has evaporated, so time to add the sugar to the caramelized tomatoes. Add sugar to taste. I will use about two and a half tablespoons of sugar. Cook the tomatoes again until they become caramelized. At that point, I will add the oil. The tomatoes that I set aside to caramelize are now ready. The tomatoes are now fully cooked and caramelized. So I will now add the vegetable oil. I use about two tablespoons. The oil makes the caramelized tomatoes shiny. Cook for a little longer. I am going to check once again on the tomatoes. As you can see, it's caramelized and shiny. I will turn off the heat and let it cool. Meanwhile, we are going to check again on the tagine. The tagine is ready as well. Let's put it down here. Now I am going to boil some quail eggs for decoration. Let them boil, then we'll use them in the tagine. The eggs are cooked, so I will place them in cold water before I peel them. Let's
let's peel the eggs. Everything is now ready, so we are going to serve the tagine. Shape the caramelized tomatoes with a spoon, like this. Place the eggs on top. Sprinkle the tomatoes with the sesame seeds. The chicken tagine with caramelized tomatoes is now ready. I hope you'll like it and try it at home. Enjoy!